Hello guys, um, well, I have, I just bought the, um, Otter Box from my iPod Touch today, as you can see. It's, it's great, like, you can toss it around, as you can see, I'll, I'm gonna test it in a few minutes to show y'all, but it's really good, like, it protects your screen really well, and, um, a lot of people I, I see have trouble when you first get it, you push down the screen, and there's little air pockets, and it takes about a month to go away. Well, I figured out a way to um get rid of that problem, like right as you buy it. Well, first off, when you put the the case on, there's a little like a little blank space between the iPhone itself or the iPod itself and the screen on the box, the Otter box. So. You gotta fill that space so there's no extra air pockets. And the way you do that is you buy a screen protector and you put it on your iPhone or your iPod. And when you put it on, there's no bubbles. As you can see, there's no bubbles on mine right now. I'm pushing pretty hard right now. And, and it's a really protective case. The iPod is about $30 at the max. For like the iPhone, I think it's like $50, $40, 50 yeah, $50. But it's it's worth it. Like when you just drop it, it it's really protective. This is the one for the iPod. Like I said, it works pretty well. As you can see, it drops really pr pretty good. You can drop it from high. It works good. Like you can toss and stuff, and it doesn't crack at all. As you can see, I tried it on the concrete later earlier when I got it and it worked just as well you might have some like brush marks on it but you can just like take your tongue and go like that and rub it and it comes straight off it comes for the iPod it only comes in black which I think the black pretty looks pretty cool if you ask me but again if you, if you have an iPod and you're having trouble with the um the uh the air pockets, just buy a screen protector, put it on your iPhone or iPod, and then you put it on and you won't have that problem. I figured that out today. <laughs> well, you could throw it and it really doesn't do anything, as you can see. You can toss it around, do whatever you want. I'll, I'll hold it way up here and I'll toss it down for y'all. And then I'll show y'all. As y'all can see, it's perfectly fine right now. It's not broken or anything. This sometimes, the rubber may kind of come like that and stuff, but it's no big deal. No big deal. Well, thank you guys. Thank you for watching. And if you have any questions, please comment or email me. Alright, thank you. Bye.